Well, Tom Burke is an environmental policy advisor. Obama is going to Alaska because Alaska is in the front line of climate change, and it's where we're seeing the impacts of a changing climate on human beings really dramatically already right now. And he wants to draw attention to the fact that it's a climate changing now. So we're seeing coastal villages having to move because the absence of ice means that there is a lot of erosion uh, of their uh, shore. We're beginning to see changes in the pattern of fish uh, moving as the temperatures of the water change. We're beginning to see animals affected like uh, walruses, for instance, 100,000 walruses on a beach in Alaska because they can't find any ice uh, near enough. So we're beginning to see these quite dramatic changes. And that uh, is a sign of what's to come in the rest of the world if we go on allowing the climate to change. Obama, in giving the go-ahead for Shell to drill in the Arctic, has uh, uh, clearly upset a lot of environmentalists and caused some people to doubt whether he's serious in his attempts to deal with climate change. I think the rest of the evidence suggests there's no question about his seriousness, his willingness to put himself out. But I think the expecting politicians in any area to be completely consistent is is kind of pretty optimistic. What really matters is what is the overall direction of travel. And in that sense, Obama has been probably more clear than any other politician in the world.